Hi. As Labour politicians reveal their non-solution to the housing crisis, it seems it merely amounts to the pipe dream of getting first-time buyers onto the housing ladder. Tens of millions will remain suspended in a housing limbo. There's no indication that a Labour administration will embark on the only logical solution to the housing nightmare, a mass social housing crash programme given absolute priority. There's plenty of flats to rent in my area of Whitechapel. Recently constructed new builds, thousands of flats in fact. Problem is, the rent for a one-bedroom flat in Lehman Street is an eye-watering £1,300 a week, not including the £7,800 deposit. To give just one random example, just a few hundred yards away saw the Maddox House fire in Shadwell with one fatality and 14 rendered homeless when the one flat they shared was destroyed by fire. Some of these people are squatting in much better circumstances in the formerly empty convent vacated by the Sisters of Mercy. About three dozen previously homeless have, under the auspices of the autonomous winter shelter, squatted the building with the support of local, mainly Bengali, working-class community. These homeless include evictees who can no longer afford sky-high rent increases, ex-sofa circus and literally the street homeless. They are threatened with eviction, the police spearheading off their own initiative, this attempt to render these people homeless once again. Other mass squats in the former commercial buildings are planned and we must do everything to support them with eviction resistance and spread the example and substitute direct action for the meaningless politics of the right and left. It's long overdue. About time we started immediately solving the many problems that beset us without recourse to politicians or any other would-be saviours and began to assert ourselves as a class from below in a rejectionist, anarchic manner. After all, what else is there to do? Bye.